Hey everybody, it's Maggie from Personal Euphoria with today's plank story. Um, so if you don't want to do plank, today I'm going to suggest rock your head side to side if that feels okay, then a few shoulder shrugs, and keep alternating between a little neck and head movement and then a little shoulder shrug or shoulder roll. You can explore, throw in some variety. All right, so... Uh, I think this all started around the time, maybe I was in sixth grade, but I think it was junior high. And I grew up in Waterford, Connecticut on the 95 corridor. And if you drove 95 towards Rhode Island, there were these three bridges you went under. And again, around this time, someone had spray painted on the first bridge, what's gonna set you free? And the local paper there, the New London Day, did an article about what a profound question that is. You're just driving down 95 and then you get hit with this very profound question. And I don't know how quickly, I don't remember the timing, but I feel like roughly within a year, on the second bridge, someone sprayed, how about some chocolate chip cookies and milk? And again, the paper did another article on like, oh, you've asked this profound question and the answer seems so simple. And, and at the time, the Got Milk ads were very popular. And so my best friend, Julie, and I, uh, thought these bridges were fabulous and that we should spray paint got milk on the third because you'd have this profound question and then this simple response and then do you have the simple thing you need to provide what you need from this profound question so we just thought we had come up with a great little interplay of like questioning enough but also playing with this marketing campaign that was so famous but we couldn't do that our parents aren't going to drive us to spray paint a bridge so we decide when we turn 16 this is going to this is going to be what we do and believe it or not when we turn 16 we remembered this now i turned 16 before julie but julie was willing to attend driver's ed and i was not so she got her license before me and sure enough we went and we drove to the top of this bridge and spray painted got milk and we were so excited right we've been fulfilling this thing we thought about for years we again thought we'd come up with the perfect response to these two questions and the paper never wrote about our perfect response it never got an article and eventually i don't know the town or the state covered over um all the the all three bridges and took away all the words which was a shame because i don't know then there was just blobs of paint. Um, or I guess you could say, you know, uh, maybe you shouldn't have done an illegal thing like spray paint bridges. I, I don't know. Either way, I hope you have a wonderful day. And as always, keep moving.